Hey, it's Elizabeth off grid. And today we're going to talk about the plans for this conversion. I'm converting a 2012 Honda Civic into a camper for one person. So first let's start in the front here in the passenger seat. I'm planning to put in either a cooler, which I already have, or eventually a very, very, very tiny fridge. And then the rest of up here will be food storage and cooking inside the car storage. A lot of that I'm talking about is just making a sandwich and stuff like that. But I will also have, I already have a rice cooker that works on 12 volts and I'll have a way to heat up food. And I already have a way to um, boil water for, you know, coffee or tea or oatmeal or whatever. Then the backs, we're going to have the, utilize the pass through to put in a bed. It will have a platform, the whole thing, I've taken out the seats, the whole thing will have a platform back there. And then I'll have a foam topper, a four inch foam topper is what I'm planning to do, which I will cover. Um, I have a sewing machine, I'm gonna sew that myself. On the two sides, you know, on the sides, there'll be some room. So on the sides, one of the sides will have the battery, which will be a power station, all inclusive kind of battery. And then the other side will have some storage and I'm planning to put in a tiny, tiny sink, like just enough to wash your hands, brush your teeth, that kind of stuff. I will make it custom. If I do that, I will be making it all custom because there's no sink that would fit possibly there. It will be like a metal bowl that I drill a hole in the bottom and I do put in all custom stuff. The most simple, simple thing I could possibly do is what I will be making we'll see how that goes but the first phase is going to be putting in the bed and covering the windows so i'm going to make custom covers for the windows the insulation i'm going to use i'm not using reflectix or any of that stuff i'm going to be using sheep's wool i also putting sheep's wool in the bottom under where this seat used to be because it's bare metal right now and it lets in a lot of sound and it lets in a lot of um cold or heat or you know depending upon what it is outside so the window covers I'm gonna make myself using magnets on the sides and then probably Velcro the front and back. I'm gonna to have to test that out. And then a layer of fabric, a black fabric one side and a lighter fabric on the other side. I'm also going to insulate up here. This is a huge source of heat. If I touch this when it's really hot outside and the sun is on it, it is boiling. So I also plan to insulate that. I like never use this. So I'm just going to put insul put sheep's wool up there as insulation. That's the kind of overall of the, of the plan. I am going to also share information about my current budget and the specifics of the order in which I'm doing it and how I'm tracking everything. Again, this is Elizabeth Off Grid. If you would like to watch more videos about converting a Honda Civic into a car camper, please subscribe. Thumbs up if you found this video interesting or helpful and comment if you have any ideas or thoughts you'd like to share. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.